Hey guys, welcome back to my epic run of with like eight people right off the bat. Uh, really, really lucky. And today, uh, we will be. There will be two slug ships in in communication wings, but we'll tap their frequency. And they're talking about how they're preparing to raid an infamous yet wealthy uh, pirate ship in this area. So let's head over there. And also, I think I'm gonna power up the uh, teleporter by one more point. Because uh, I don't really see the point in not doing that. If I would feel... I feel obligated to. So we're going to go down one here just because I'm trying to now get to a store. And there's now a slug cruiser. A magic ship that looks to be hunting slugs on its home turf. A rare test of honor for the mightiest of... Uh, of mantis crews. This is like an abnormally difficult one. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to board it. And we're gonna just wait until his teleport comes back up. They're taking out like my weapons, and like I don't have any weapons. And now they're bored with this area. I'm just I'm just continuously like oh look at that, they have no they have no weapons anymore. Let's take out their teleporter so they can't leave. Actually wait, no. We'll just, uh, it's one guy? This whole time I'm like, oh, he must be a strategical genius. And he left. What a prick. What the hell? There's no life signs on the ship. He's did I kill their oxygen? How did he die? I think he just, like, he came back. It's like, my, my NG lover is dead. Life is not worth living anymore. He committed suicide. And thus ends the epic tale of the lone, the lone mantis ship with one, one boarding crew. Uh, so there's a slug repair station. They want to fix me up. No, thank you. Because uh, they, it's usually, you know what? You know what? There's something you need to know about slugs. They're giant assholes and they trick you all the time. They go like, oh, you want to repair a ship? And then they don't do it. All right, well, there's a, this is like the easiest ship ever. What we're going to do is we're going to board this one because we don't ever want to go into that oxygen bay because there's no oxygen there. So let's go into here. It's a slug cruiser too, these poor guys. I, I almost feel bad killing them. Almost. Oh well, we might as well go cloak. I mean, there's no three-person bay here, so I might as well just, like, dick around and, and have a good time. Oh, now they want shields, huh? Okay. And, uh, th they gave me a hull beam, which is pretty much... It's telling me to do a beam weapon run, which is what people want to see. Alright. Uh, nope, no point in doing anything here but healing up and going into the next area. Honestly, I wouldn't mind trying to do a one weapon run. That, that seems kind of fun. I just need a one weapon that costs one power. It, it's, it's, it seems kind of challenging. I don't know. Or maybe it's just like artificial difficulty. Who the hell knows? I don't really need it. Uh, okay, so there's a slug colony on a huge asteroid. Uh, it'll take weeks to get mucus out of your clothes, but th there's business to be done. All right. I love fire beams so much. <laughs> it's tempting. It really is, but I think we'll save that for another time. I'm, 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 I'm now. I think I'm now committed to doing a, a one, one weapon run. Let's get a defense drone in though. So no weapons except for, uh, the one, one, one bay thing here. So whatever I get, uh, you know, it's it's cool for me. All right, let's let's head over to that guy who wanted. Uh, oh, there's a an ion storm threat threatens to deactivate my systems. Okay, well, whatever. We'll go and, and board this guy. So this this way, I'm actually killing his his weapons while they're preoccupied. Wow, we can take out his engines. Like, why would you not have doors to this shit? Like, seriously. It seems like the kind of obvious thing. Let's see how all my people are doing. Wow, a lot of them are leveling up that the, those weapons pretty fast. Especially this this Walker guy's getting is the slowest one. And that's it. We strip the ship. And that's 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 how we do with that. 
That's uh, slugs are rather uninteresting to board because they don't they have ships like this with no med bays or whatever. We get defense. We get a defense drone now, which is kind of nice because now I can activate that and get some nice missile defense, which is something I definitely want. And we continue on our way down to the quest marker. And this guy had. Okay, well, there's a civilian ship that's being chased by a pirate. Let's go aid him. Oh, okay, so this guy actually has doors. Whatever. You know what? Let's just board him. He's got no med bay, so not, nothing to be concerned about. We'll just add cloak to evade all the f fire. Now you you can come right in, sir. Wonder if this guy's gonna be depressed and just leave the ship too. Eh, let's get all our our crew members onto onto here. I'm always I'm always kind of wondering what the hell is going on there. I might actually get like another point in sensors. Oh, this time this time he didn't die. Oh well. Oh no, he did die. <laughs> what the fuck? I don't get it. Maybe he maybe I killed him before he left. I don't know. Oh, there's a. Uh, uh, a crew wants some crew wants to join my ship. Uh, one offer. Okay, well, what, what, what? Who would I have to get rid of? It's a slug. You know what? You know what? Let's get rid of the human I have. This guy's not that good at piloting. Fuck him. Let's get a slug for piloting. There you go. See, he, he replaced him immediately. He knew his job. This way, I can actually see what's on their ship and what's on my own ship and stuff. You know, I don't actually have to get that level, those level two sensors. It's 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 valuable intel for a ship like this. The only other thing I would have replaced him with is like a NG or something for repair speed. But this is good. Just say he just sits there and gives me valuable intel. I like the sound of that. I am constantly on low fuel. It's ridiculous. Okay, it's two. Uh, you catch up to two uh, slug ships and they're carrying out the raid. One in close combat with the pirate, with the other one heading for a small cache. So I can either head for the cache or engage a pirate. Oh wait, wait. Uh, so they, they want to say we suggest you distract the pirate vessel while we retrieve the valuables. Uh, no, let's just head for the cache because I don't trust them. They're fucking dicks. So, uh, oh, so they they left me to tow with the pirate. Okay. Oh, well, that's good for him. He only has two crew members, and they have no medbay either. So uh, this is not even a contest. I mean, it's four boarding crew. That poor slug. He has no idea. All right. Well, I get the cash for myself, but it's lost. Well, no, I didn't. I didn't. I searched for it, but it's lost in clouds. I con I console myself with the with the with the uh, well armed pirate ships uh, goodies, and they they actually were really good. Like I got like um, look at this. This was like this was well armed. Three three blocks of shields this early on. Thank goodness I'm a boarding ship. Holy jeez. Always something to be thankful for. Okay, so I still have stealth weapons for some reason. I don't really know why I have that. I I, I think it was a good idea at the time, but you know, I'm, I'm starting to regret that. Well, not really. Oh, whatever, it's okay. So there's distress beacon. It's and di with difficulty to one of the seven moons of the hidden planet of the nebula. And he goes, uh, I shall join your crew. Can you answer a simple question? How many? Oh, shit. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, so there's seven. Yeah. And uh, he offers to join my crew. It's Kirby. I like his name better. Fuck you, Lana. We got, we'd have crew. How many crew members do I get? <laughs> I am shitting crew members right now. <laughs> I literally just chose another crew member just because I liked his name better. Kirby. <laughs> I love you, Kirby. Okay. Uh... They sabotaged my oxygen product, uh, production system, and they prepared to allow me to suffocate. That's okay. We'll just we'll be done like in no time. I mean, look 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 how fast I kill these guys. And then we'll just oh, might as well power up cloak. Oxygen will not like even deplete like past like sixty percent. Look at this. And we go and uh, all our systems go back to normal. You know, it may have been panic time if, like, I wasn't amazing with my luck in this game. Like, holy shit. Like, I, I, like, what, someone keep a counter, please. Like, I, I need to know. 
Like at this point, I'm just, I'm just, I'm treating it as a joke, and I'm just like getting rid of crew members just for fun. All right. Well, I have a shit ton of scrap, and I was saving it for like a place where I could, uh, you know, have, um, <laughs> uh, what's we call it? Uh, get weapons, but I guess that's not necessary. I'll get another block of shields. Um, I don't know what else to get. I can get like more sensors, but I already have the slug crew member for that. I can get doors, sure. Let's 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 get doors. Because everyone tells me all the time to go get doors, so... I don't want to be a condescending douche. Oh, there's a civilian be ship being chased by a pirate. I'll aid the civilian ship, and we power up our weapons. Alright. So let's just go beam directly onto the ship. And we're gonna just do this right away. Now we can't leave. Wow. Okay, well, we got 44 scrap out of that. And the pirate ship that was a science vessel. Yeah, I love science vessels. Greetings, command. Okay, uh, anyways, they gave me a small reward. That's kind of nice. I, I would say that who said all the lab monkeys free, but I have an ongoing F uh, System Shock 2 LP where I've done I've done that joke like three times. I think this is, this is, this is like the month of, of, of science vessels. Both jokes and otherwise. Okay. Get another point for engines, because I, I I have OCD and I want it to be an even number. Oh, let's go. Hey, there's a store right here. That sounds good to me. A suck teleports on my bridge and he wants to give me shit. Okay. Uh I would def Ooh. Damn. I'm unfortunately doing Wow, can I really I, I don't think I can get level one la level uh whatever level whatever lasers. Just occurred to me. I can't get anything that attacks. I get a heavy la- no, heavy lasers are too rare. Damn. I need to get another point into the weapons. Oh, that sucks for me. Alright. Let's get long range sen sensors and burst laser. Fine. I would like to get that last fuel, but that's not necessary. Uh, I have to, because in the last- on the final boss, I have to be able to attack- or maybe I don't. You know what? If I find a drone... That attacks, I'm gonna replace him. And I'm gonna kill the final boss with a drone. A single drone. That actually sounds good to me. I'm gonna do that. I didn't even think about that. Okay, so we can jump to the next sector. He's offering to repair damage. I don't need repairs. Okay. Uh, so I guess Mantis or Slug. Uh, you know what? We have the ability to see through things. There's a whole shit ton of nebulas. I hope you guys like nebulas. I can't see the slugs, but they're watching. And so that means now I can just kind of chill out here. And there's a rebel ship here. I'll attack the ship. Why do I care? They should be fearing me. I don't have to fear. I have nothing to fear from them. The cloak is purely a tactical maneuver. That's all I'll use it for. Okay, and these guys are done. And we'll cloak to evade this guy. And they have no medbay. These silly, pathetic humans have no medbay. Well, that'll teach them for being human, in a game like FTL. And there's a prisoner who offers to- Okay, what's the counter up to now? Like, 50? <laughs> this is- This really is a USS- I should name all my ships the USS Overpowered, because this, this just seems to happen. <laughs> I am loving this. I am so loving this. Now, I thought the Burst Laser Mark 1 would only take up one power, but I was wrong. That that was thinking actually of a, that what the stealth ship gets, which is like a... That one gets a level 1 laser. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. Hey, look, it's, uh... It's you. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna teleport directly into here. Prevent him from entering his own med bay. Okay, cool. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave. That's cool with me. I might as well cloak. I'm kind of worried about this guy, though. Yeah, let's go get this guy to go over here. Okay, and this way, this way he's not being attacked. That's my plan for this guy. Organize them so everyone gets a bit of experience and we strip the ship off of remaining useful materials. That's it. This whole time I'm like, I was wondering, I'm like, will I get enough crew to to support my my demanding needs for a fulfilling 
uh, crew. <laughs> wonder how much a heal bomb takes up. Maybe I'll have the heal bomb too. If I find one. I think, you know what, the best setup here would be iron bomb and heal bomb, to be honest. That sounds like the best thing to me. Alright, uh, well there's a store right there. We'll go there right after we kill this guy. Because this is why I got the long range sensors, so now I'll be able to board everybody. And so there's a ship, there's a ship with slug markings and it's a pirate insignia. Whatever, I'm not going to re reconsider. He's already dead, he just doesn't, doesn't know it. The minute he saw me on long range sensors, he's already dead. Which is kind of how it goes down. Realistically, at this point, all I want to do is like level up this, these guys. So, you know, getting another two points into, uh, into evade is actually not, not beyond what I would want to do here. 90% chance is still pretty good. Okay, no more life signs on the ship. Let's go and strip it of useful materials, and that's it. I am having a good time with this ship. <laughs> I, wonder, I, wonder, like, I wonder if I could, like, speed run this game and just kind of run right through the, all this. I think I'm doing, like, faster than what I normally do, but, you know, still. I don't, I don't really know. Alright, well, there's a nice store here. Let's go see what he has to sell for me. Uh, defense drone, a hull repair drone. That's nice. Uh, I'll keep... Uh, should I keep that around? Yeah, I think it's nice to keep around. Hey, look, I can buy more crew if I really so choose to. Okay. System repair drone, uh, might as well keep him around. There's really no sense in not keeping the system repair drone around, although I w really wish he had one of the anti-ship fighters. Hey, look, it's this guy. Hey, he's gonna try and burn me out. Because he's got, like, a bunch of weapons. And he has a fancy cloak. Oh, well, I, I have the same thing. Okay. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna just, uh... Okay, he's got a lot of weapons there. Even though even though he's healing, I can get him pretty quickly. And here's one of the really cool things. This guy outside of the room can prevent them from entering here. So I I I I technically get three of these things. And he cloaks. We want we want to prevent him from entering the med bay. That's actually one of the more important things to, for us to be doing right now. He, he just fired a lot of lasers. Okay, well, it's already it's already done. Assuming he doesn't get some kind of lucky shot off on me. Actually, we can just bring them all up here. No, he doesn't want to... He doesn't want to come over. Actually, no. Let's get this guy back here and bring this guy in. Uh, that's it. Their ship is done. Uh, the hacking module brings things to normal and we're okay. So, I don't know. That was not very difficult, but, you know, whatever. It was close, I guess, for a second there. That's the, that's the thing is, boarding ships are really OP as it is. Having one where you can bring four frickin' people onto the ship at once? That's ridiculous. It really is. <laughs> There's no stopping you. So this this one and the Manta ship are just so ridiculous. All right. Um, so it's unfortunate. I'll go to the store actually. Where this is not unfortunate at all. So it's the Slugs Colony, and they have anti ship drone. Yeah, we're good. Okay, we're gonna get the anti ship drone. We're gonna sell the burst laser that I bought. Uh, so this is this requires two power. This requires two power. Sell that guy, and we're done. Oh, and also buy a shit ton of fuel. Uh, I could buy drones, but I'm not particularly... If you haven't noticed, I haven't really been using the, the drones to begin with. So I think I'll be okay. Oh no, it's a Mantis ship, a rare test of honor. Whatever. Let's go get his med bay. Oh shit, there's a mantis that got in here. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna de we're gonna unpower that guy. Okay, we got that. Uh, and they fired a missile at us, so we're just gonna cloak real quick. We're 
we're also gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna unpower this, and they're gonna attack us here. That's okay. <laughs> they don't really want to be in this ship at all. I'm I'm just kind of just killing them slowly. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna continue to kill them remotely. Now I can I can power up a defense drone to prevent that missile, but it's not a very powerful missile, so I don't think it's very urgent that I do that. And um, it, it, he missed anyways. No, I feel if I leave, then they're gonna come onto the ship. That's it. Okay. Well, apparently he decided not to. I thought he'd beam back on, and I'm like, okay. Apparently he he was depressed. The poor mantises. It's got it's gotta be kind of shitty about being a mantis because they're like they look like they look like bugs. It's got to bring a lot of pressure in the workplace. All right, let's get everyone to repair. Just occurred to me I don't really have anyone for repairing. That's what the system repair drone is for. But who needs repairs when you don't intend on taking any damage? And I get the rock out of dude or some shit. No, I'll be okay. The system repair drone was going to do that, but you know. Oh shit, there's a store here. Well, I have everything I need, you know what? It's okay. That's obviously where all the ion bombs are, but that's okay. Uh, and there's a... There's a rebel ship here, who's moving off the radar, so instead of chasing them like I usually do and I lose, I'm gonna use the long range scanner. That sounds good. And uh... I squeeze what I can out of malfunctioning sensors. What? Oh, well, that's, that's cause uh... My sensors were. I'm in a nebula. Uh, let's go into the shield bay. I don't, oh shit, they have a guy here. They have a boarding drone? Really? Out of all the things? I'm just gonna kill their crew, so. Well, you can have that. That's all yours. I don't want to lose my- I don't want to lose Kirby, my favorite slug. That's it, his ship doesn't have anything else of any use. Alright, these guys don't suffocate as quickly, so we're gonna bring them over down there. Because there's no air here anymore, but they're- they- look how, they don't lose health very fast, so... Now don't do anything dumb, Mike, like trap my crew members in my own fucking bay here. I would too, and you'd know it. This guy seem, seemed to deplete his health faster. That was kind of weird. Okay, that's equalized pressure, and we're good. And you get back on your you get back on your post, and we will be on our merry way back to a happy beginnings. Which I don't know what the fuck that means, but you know, I want to say something profound. I don't say profound things often enough. Hey, right, cool. We got two uh, two more ships here to fight. And they cut off my O2 supply. Well, I'm gonna cut off your. I'm gonna call, cut off your life supply. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't have many retaliations for something as dickish as removing my air supply. We'll we'll equalize pressure in the ship though, just so. Because uh, this guy didn't have a lot of air to begin with, so this this way I. Oh. It's a good thing that didn't do damage for some. Oh, it did. Fi it's fire damage. And I got long-range sensors out of it, which I already have, and have drone parts and some fuel and stuff like that. Uh, but I break it down into scrap because I don't need it, and it gives me 25 scrap, which is, I think, the same price as if I had just sold it normally. Alright. Oh no, my, 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 my drone bay. My only weakness. How do you know that my, my ship was completely powered by drones? Whatever. These slugs are not the most intelligent of people. Let me just say that. Honestly, the, the bombs are like the most threatening thing to me with this ship because it's just like, I don't know what to do. Holy shit, I have like 200 scrap. What am I going to spend this on? I don't know. <laughs> More engines! Yeah. Now, now, we're, now we're seriously taking evading to the, to the max. Alright, what do we have here? Uh, it's a slug ship. 
Again, well, I don't know what else you would expect at this point. Alright. Bill Gates, use your ability. No. Okay, so we're gonna use this guy's ability when this thing goes down to minimal. You can kind of see how, how well it's doing. Like that. Because I, I, I really don't like med bays because then they go run into it all the time. This this prevents movement into it. I can kill them faster than they can kill me in this place. I have a shit ton of shields too. I might as well close my doors. No, my weapons. God damn it. Have you guys no honor? Now I can't retaliate. Yeah, we'll win. And we strip the ship of any remaining resources and that's it. We're good. And everyone live happily ever after. You can go help out with that. Actually, no, you need healing. Never mind. I, I do like I do like like how perfect this crew is. I mean, the only way it could be more perfect is if this guy was an NG, but he's already like leveled up and like dodging like to the like a lot. I'm gonna I'm gonna just heal him slightly. Does anyone else need healing? Yeah, my OCD is kicking in. Just looking at this guy, it's like oh, he's not full health. Oh wait, wait, our weapons are down. That's important to 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 heal. It, it serves as a useful distraction. They'll be like, we'll target the next guy's weapons, and it's like I don't even use them. Let's let's see if I can do this entire game without powering up weapons. I I know that uh, anti ship drone counts as a weapon, but shut up. You're not my mother. All right. Oh, it's an unmanned craft. Let's try it. No, 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 two, because I can't, I can't beam out more than two. So there's no air on the ship. However, we can get weapons really fast. Oh, my O2. Right, right in the O2. So I'm gonna kill his weapon so he can't attack him back. Then I'll attack his shields and I'll put on a drone. Wow, my my, that's already up. Wow. How, how many fucking, how, how much time does it take for them to kill weapons? Whatever. Come back here. Go good. Go get delicious heals. Oh wait, I already have my medbay powered. Whoops. Probably shouldn't have done that. Okay, I'm gonna go after his shields next. I just gotta let these guys heal back up to full. Okay, you're good. Oh, uh, you know, this is good practice for the guys who are manning shields, you know. I figure. This is fun. <laughs> yeah, these guys I'm not concerned about because they don't suffocate as quickly, which means they're the best for boarding this kind of ship. Alright. Second that goes down. Done. Okay. I was kind of worried that he would shoot my own guy, but whatever. D it didn't actually happen, so we're okay. It's like the slowest anti-ship drone ever. Look at this, he's actually doing a good job. He's like he's like hitting all key systems. Good job, anti-ship drone. You get a promotion. Too bad I can't take you with me. But you're an admiral now. Just know that while you sit in space. The, the knowledge of that should be should be reward enough for what you've done. Alright. Uh well we can go to the exit, or we can go to one of two more exits. I think, you know, we need to get as much exploration and this is that kind of game. And it's a giant hunk of rock entirely you mined out of useful materials. I guess we'll just go to the last one because I might as well. A slug machine... Uh, do you want payment? They're not falling for it. They just kill the crew and strip it. Okay. I'm not getting out of here without a fight. That's fine by me. We'll just kill him. Actually, let's go kills weapons. 
weighing weighing all the things I should be killing, you know, that seems like the, the best thing. Hey, what's it? How's this guy with evade? Very good, and this guy is very good as well. Holy crap! Okay, and there's a burst laser Mark One with some scrap. Okay, well, apparently I got. Apparently, it's returned to haunt me. It's, it's just kind of like you need that laser, and I'm like, uh, and I I failed to power up my engines completely, but you know that's okay. I failed to do a lot of things. Okay, well, this is uh, definitely an interesting run. <laughs> I'm I'm having fun with it, and there's a FTL drive, and so I can get trade. I'm gonna get some drone parts. Sure, why not? Drone parts are useful. So we'll go to a rock control sector just because we have one more nebula in between. And I don't want to bore you to death with nebulas, so that's what we'll do. Okay, and that's pretty much it for today. This was a particularly long episode. I apologize for that, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.